Astro's Chanyu makes an unexpected cameo in the first episode of Strong Girl Namsoon. Following the immense success of the original series, the latest K-drama, Strong Girl Namsoon, has made its debut. A sequel to the popular show Strong Woman Do Bong Soon, the new series shifts its focus to Namsoon played by Lee Yumi, a cousin of the previous protagonist, and her burgeoning relationship with Gong Hee-sik portrayed by Ong Song-woo, successfully capturing the hearts of netizens. In the initial episodes, it's disclosed that Namsoon was raised in Mongolia and, upon recalling her Korean roots, dedicates years to prepare for a journey to find her birth parents. During this process, she immerses herself in Korean culture, bringing Astro's Chanyu into the storyline. A new known for his talent captivating visuals and charm since his debut, becomes part of Namsoon's narrative. Namsoon expresses her desire to marry a Korean man and protect him, revealing her fondness for Anyu through a book filled with his pictures, captioned with Let's Meet Someday. In a charming moment, she playfully contemplates what she would do if guys started vying for her attention. Following the episode, netizens expressed their delight at Anyu's unexpected appearance in the series. The inclusion of Anyu in the storyline further solidifies his status as an ideal type for many. What are your thoughts on this? Let me know in the comments below. Astro's Chanyu and Song Kang make unexpected cameos in K-drama Welcome to Sondari. The recent premiere of the JTBC K-drama Welcome to Sondari has already captivated audiences, starring Ji Chong Wook as Cho Young Pil, a weather forecaster, and Shin Hae-sun as Cho Song Dal, a photographer seeking redemption in her hometown. Netflix describes the storyline as follows, after suffering a fall from grace, a photographer returns to her hometown and bumps into her childhood friend, rekindling an unfinished romance. While the show boasts a star-studded cast, there were unexpected cameo appearances by some beloved stars. Given Samdal's character as a renowned celebrity photographer in Seoul, she has captured images of some of the hottest actors, including Song Junki, Sung Kang, and Lee Jong Suk along with singer Lee Hyori. These brief appearances can be spotted in episode 1. Song Kang in particular made not just one but two appearances. Additionally, he showed up in episode 3 as his photo was being taken down, featuring an actual image from a GQ photoshoot. Surprisingly, Astro's Chanyu received a special mention when viewers discovered that Bae Myung Jin's character, Chanyu, shares a name with the idol actor. To add to the surprise, they showcased a news photo in the restaurant while discussing him. Did you catch any other unexpected cameos in the drama? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments below. Chan Woo, one of the biggest heartthrobs of Korean showbiz. Astro's Chan Woo, a popular idol turned actor, captures the hearts of many fangirls. Because of his great looks, sweet personality, and impressive academic record. Top visual with a sexy body. Chan Wu was born on March 30, 1997, and is an artist under Fantejo Corp. He made his debut as a member of the boy group Astro in February 2016. But after the release of many albums, the group still could not rise to fame and grab much attention from the public. Chan Wu gradually became more noticed in the industry, thanks to his stunning appearance. His face is considered K-pop's top visuals, both by fans and non-fans. A variety show that made Chan Wu popular was Law of the Jungle. Showing off his flawless bare face and toned six-pack body, he went viral in Korean online communities. Korean netizens did not expect that a guy looking as pretty and dreamy as Chan Wu would have such a masculine body. Chan Wu was once voted the most handsome rookie in 2016. 
Throughout the years, he always tops the visual rankings among Korean male celebrities of the new generation. Whether it is a childhood pre-debut photo or a netted fan taken photo using a phone's camera, Sean Woo always looks radiant and attractive. He quickly became the most popular member of Astro, even overshadowed other members and began to engage in many solo activities. He almost couldn't make his debut due to his studies. Sean Woo has long been regarded as the ideal man. The male singer went to prestigious schools, served as president of the student council, and was ranked among the top three students in the entire school. Chan Wu has been able to play a variety of instruments from childhood, including the piano, violin, and guitar. The male singer competed in a variety of speaking and English contests. Chan Wu became interested in robotics and machine engineering when he was in junior high school, so he focused all of his attention on learning machine programming. In addition, he was once the captain of the soccer and basketball teams. Many people thought Chan Wu was like a character right out of a movie, as he's perfect. Before becoming an idol, Chan Wu dreamed of becoming a prosecutor and determined to enter law school. The male idol shared that his worst drop in high school was top 20, and he was always in top 3 before that. Chan Wu explained his ranking drop on the show Hello Counselor as a result of the time he had to prepare to become an idol. According to the male singer, it was thanks to his high school teacher that he was able to become an idol. The teacher asked as to whether Chan Wu had been invited to audition for any entertainment company. The male idol stated that he had been invited by Fante Jo, but that he was unable to attend because the schedule conflicted with his class. This teacher then let Unwoo skip class and go to the audition instead. Chan Woo always has actions that make women flutter. During a press conference, when Chan Woo saw that his female co-star wanted to drink water, the male idol took the initiative to help Im Soo Hyung open the bottle of water and give it back to her. Just a small act of him created a buzz, making all the girls' hearts flutter. During a broadcast, a viewer stated that she had dropped out of a school test to watch Chan Wu's livestream. The male idol became mad right away, telling the fan that she shouldn't miss the test, that it would only happen once, and that she could watch the livestream afterwards. Despite being the most popular member of the group, Chan Wu feels guilty for being so outstanding compared to the rest of the members. The handsome male idol once confided, Recently I'm very tired of everything, obviously it's for the benefit of the group and myself. But now I don't really know. I'm very worried. It's been a long time since the last time I performed with the members. Anwu always reads comments online, both negative and positive. Although he is doing well, he is worried about the group's image. He wants Astro to become more and more famous, not just himself. The male singer's sincere confession deeply touched fans. Chan Wu is always gentle with women. A female idol once texted him to confess her love, but he kept silent as a refusal. When meeting this female colleague again at a music show, An Wu still kept a normal attitude and greeted her to avoid her feeling awkward. Chan Wu is an untouchable boy of fangirls. Chan Wu gained recognition after appearing in the 2018 drama My ID is Gone on Beauty. He has proved himself to be a potential rising star in this new field with his flawless visual and improved acting skills. This is why he has become the dream boy of so many fangirls. Chan Wu was once rumored to be dating actress Jo Worry because of their close interactions with each other behind the scenes. Thinking that Jo Worry was flirting with her co-star, 
his fans attacked Joe Worry with criticism. However, this rumor was immediately forgotten, since netizens believed Chan Wu was too perfect for any girl. Even when Chan Wu revealed that he had already watched R rated movies, his fans still considered it cute. They commented, Wow, did my heart flutter hearing him talk about that topic? I don't even like that kind of movie. He's freaking cute. This is so wrong. But why am I jealous of people who acted in that movie? Anwu doesn't tell a lie. He's so cute. Despite his handsome face, his little finger is quite short, and that makes him unable to shape a perfect heart with his hands. But even this sounds like a cute thing to fans. Chan Wu is definitely an untouchable boy, and it seems like nothing could damage his image in the eyes of fangirls. In addition, he once ranked number two in the monthly individual brand reputation chart, only behind Kong Daniel. What do you think about this? Let me know in the comment below. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share if you enjoy this video. See you next time.